Hi, this is Lucy from webtrainingwheels.com and today I'm going to show you how to do a couple of simple customizations to your thesis theme, specifically the comment box area. This is based on a question that I got on my blog. What I've got here is uh, my test installation of WordPress that's running locally on my computer and you can see I've got a basic installation of the thesis theme. And you can see the default styling of the comment area. So what we want to do is actually change the background color of the comment box. So I'm using the Chrome browser and they have a really cool inbuilt tool to help you make changes. So if you go to View, Developer, and Developer Tools, you'll see this uh, panel that will help you locate the elements that you need to change. So I click the little magnifying glass and that lets me inspect different parts of the page. I'm going to select an area that's close to what I need to change and then I'm going to isolate the specific part even more. So you can see that the area I wanted to target is highlighted in blue. So if I look to the right side I can see the CSS associated with that area. So now I can preview a change here in Chrome. So I'm going to type in a background color. We can see in the preview that it does actually change the right area. So now I can take this information and put it into my custom CSS file in Thesis. So I'm going to go to my Thesis theme into the custom folder. I'm going to open up custom CSS. I'm just opening it in a basic text editor called Text Wrangler. And I'm going to type my new CSS. So with Thesis, you start with the .custom. Then I'm going to add the element that I found, comment underscore list. Then I'm going to add the rule that I put in there. And after I save this and then reload the web page, you should see my change. Great, so the comment box background is now gray as we hoped. So you can change pretty much anything about this if you want. So let's say we want to change the text of the comments. Again, I'm going to go to Developer Tools. I'm going to select the area that I want to change. So I'm going to give it a red color just so that we can see it really easily. So the comment text has changed, but you can also see that the body text has changed. So what that tells me is that um, the element that I'm targeting here is not specific enough because it's targeting too much. So I need to narrow it down and make it specific only to the area that I want to change, the comment box. So again, we can do this pretty easily with CSS. So I'm going to copy the format text P into my custom CSS, but I'm going to add something that's going to target it more specifically because we don't want all of the text to change. So I'm going to make it specific to the comment area. And let's see what happens after I save this and then refresh the browser window. Okay, so now we can see that the body text is the correct color, but we have been able to change the text of the comment box. So you can basically style the comments or any other element exactly how you want it using CSS. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.